We return, fair sailors of the galactic ship. Felix rocking the Moon Man helmet, Parvati with the goggles, and me with the good stuff. We're ready to head back to town. We gotta decide, are we gonna drop off the research with the scientists and give them back their most important work and then just pay our way to Gladys? Or are we going to turn this into glass? I currently have 9,774 bits. So basically, if I if I can just find, you know, 226 more, I can pay my way to the nav key. Or I can go return this and have a bunch of money. I mean, I they will give me inevitably some credits, probably, for returning them. But... At the same time, I think it's a little more interesting to um, take their darn research and return it elsewhere, you know? Like, it just kind of seems like a more fun... I think I just broke my foot. A more fun way to, to make magic happen, you know? Maybe? Maybe not? I don't know. Um, where's my ship? Is my, sh oh, my ship is right here. Okay, cool. Ooh, what is this? A leather boa. Oh my gosh. It's a freaking snake. That's disgusting. All right, I am, I'm making the executive decision to steal the research, give it to Gladys so we can preserve some of our coin for maybe more important expenditures later on. I don't think that, I mean, that, that force weapon sounds very cool. But two things. One, who knows if we actually got it. Well, three things. One, who knows if we actually got it. Two, who knows if it actually was going to be beneficial and for how long. And three, this game seems to have so many different ways of working things out that maybe we can give them to Gladys and still get it back at some point or maybe she'll sell it off to someone else and we can chase it down I don't know but I'm gonna go the route of of just returning it to the groundbreaker now we do have to load into the ship and then load into groundbreaker which is I don't know I feel like loads over the last year and a half have gotten so much better that Oh, I've got my danger sign. Can I put it somewhere? Oh, you can't transfer stuff in the locker. That's cute. I don't know. I feel like loads have become a bit... They're a bit more annoying now. I don't know. Some Most games, or some games, or the best games, have found ways to work around some annoying loads. Um, but, so, so when they are there, they become much more noticeable. But it, it, I guess it's to, to be expected from a big open world experience like this one i'm ready to get some new um new load screens so the faux windows was a fun one last time but we've seen mantisar examined and uh, manta pillar examined multiple times now so load me in dang it let's go moon man speed these things up if we all wear your moon man heads are you gonna be happy space is choice is he made of coconut or cheese? Like really moldy cheese that has gotten just white fuzz all over? Or more is it more of a coconutty flavor? Maybe it's a unique fruit. Maybe it's more like an apple. A cocoa apple. A crunchy apple. Head through customs. Talk to uh, Gladys and see if we can get to our next main location here. Um, she's chilling like a villain. Downstairs at the... Uh, the ends. Where is it? That's security. That's not where I want to go. Um, wait, where am I? Oh, this is where I want to be. <laughs> Through one more big door. Welcome to the promenade! It's so cool! Alright, the rest and go is where we were trying to go, go, go. Into this Gladys room. Hello, lady. Have you had a moment to look into that little opportunity I told you Man, I spent much more than a moment. Woman. You don't hurry up. Someone will get to snooping around there before you do. I'm ready for some of those cookies you promised. What's that? Speak up now. Hmm. About those secrets. What'd you turn up? Well, I found a formula for... Oh, dang it. If we convince her that the toothpaste is rocket fuel, that's so sweet. Um, okay. Um. If you... Hang on, let's get out of this real quick. 40, 40 lie and 25 sign. What did I gain? Purple berry bunch. Okay. What am I at? I'm very close to 40 lie. 
and I'm, I could I could make this happen. Okay, I'm very close to leveling up. So let's go actually, let's go complete something else, and then we can lie and probably get even more out of her. Um. Monarch. Okay, let's go to Parv let's get Parvati a drink, and maybe we can complete that quest, get enough XP to hit 11, and cash this. And I think that might I think this might actually be a, a great way to work this out. So, how's this work? Do we get a table? Stand in a corner? Okay, so what Water. are we drinking? We've got a ship to fly, a, a universe to help. Oh, and don't worry on the price. I got this. Let's just do a whole it colony to wake up, Parvati. We ain't got time. Oh no, that's just that's on account of my not being able to sleep lately. Makes my hands all twitchy, you know. If you say so, girlfriend. I've just been lying awake, thinking about what June Lay said, and feeling my heart shake. Your heart shake? That's probably not good. Although I know about panic attacks, and maybe you're just imagining things. Oh, beer. I guess, yeah, I can do that. Beer can be good. I bet. You bet. Bottoms up. All right. Enjoy beer, it right huh? in the middle of the good choice. If the you aisle. want to get unsober in a hurry. Ah, this tastes like the underside of a boot. People drink that for fun. That's what they tell me. Oh, Captain, I'm pining for June like something fierce. What am I doing? We called it generally or specifically. <laughs> specifically, definitely, definitely specifically. Oh, I like the little oh. nose scrunch there. That's a pretty cool animation. I mean, just with Junlei. I don't know what to do about. I mean, you've known her us. for like a couple days, girl. Chill out. Well, she talked about another girl, right? Isabel mentioned her by name and everything. Like she wanted me to know. Maybe I've been making a right fool of myself this whole time. Maybe she's not interested after all. I mean, what did she say about this, Isabel? Uh, I, I don't know. I'd call it uh, sensual. That's a lot. Well, the poem implied you call me here with a touch. It did. Oh dear, I hadn't really. Oh my goodness. And I told you. So, Parvati, you gonna read this poem for us, or do we have to turn down the lights first? What, yeah, what is the, the, not the poem, we know what the poem is, Felix, we're trying to figure out the message. It was real long and rambly, she was telling me a story about her dad, how a lady named Isabel did all sorts of things to try to win his favor. This Isabel lady never quite managed to get her dad's approval, but they carried on anyways, made something good out of a bad situation. Then it all went down the tubes. Do you think June Lay still has feelings for her? Probably not. I just got a lot of feelings, Captain, and they're all climbing up my throat. Okay. I, I need another drink. Right now. Before I lose my nerve. Alrighty, I'm afraid we're gonna lose you here. Let's get you some water. Come on, Captain. I'm here to drink. Water. Okay, maybe you're right. I'm a little woozy. <laughs> you can, or juice. Hydration. You got juice? Here I come. Good thinking, boss. You just saved Parvati a whole lot of trouble. Cool. Shush you. Oh, Captain, I want to talk to Junlei all the time. Even about silly things, but oh, I'm so scared. They're just like off homeworld for the first time and having a puppy love infatuation here. Come on, dude. Um, everything? I got a solar system's worth of terrifying <laughs> questions swirling around my head. Does she think I'm as pretty as I think she's handsome? What if she doesn't like me? What if she does? What if she's still got feelings for that lady, Isabel? Goodness what gracious, if we, take we a deep get together breath. And she gets bored of me. You gotta breathe, Parvati. <laughs> Don't sit there, you're on a roll. No wonder you're scared. Well, I never, I never done this before. I never really tried to pursue someone. I'm, I'm all flailing limbs and yelling like a. Little one thrown in the sea who don't know how to swim. I can definitely see that. You know I'm not interested in physical affection. That's... Well, it's tripped folks up in the past. Folks I thought cared about me for me. What if she's not okay with that? What if she is, but then later, she's not? Then you come to a compromise, buddy. <laughs> 
What do you mean, Captain? Yeah, you can't control people's emotions, no matter what. Trying to manage their feelings will drive you crazy. So I should just be myself? You sound like my dad. It's sweet. Gosh, I don't know that I got that in me. Sometimes I feel real mean inside, Captain. I think ungenerous thoughts. Yeah. I like the way you put that. Like, it's okay to want to be better for her, and not impossible to try. Well, Captain, this has been... This has been a whole lot. I got just... Wow. So much to think about. Do you think I should ask her on a... Oh, a goodness. Date? Yeah, get it over with, please. We can't, we can't do this all the time. <laughs> all right, all right. There's no need to strip your screws over it. Okay. I, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna ask June out. Just as soon as we get back to the ship. I mean, probably. Eventually. Thanks for hearing me out and giving me counsel. And, well, for being a friend. It means a whole lot. You're good people, Captain. You know something, Parvati? You ought to come drinking with the crew more often. Huh. All right. Thank you, guys. You're real good friends, you know that? I wish... I wish there was a place we could all live quiet together. Come on, let's go. Hey, 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 XP, please. Complete the quest, drinking sapphire wine, take... Oh, gosh, you take Parvati back to the ship. Look at that, we didn't quite get enough XP. We are right on the cusp. Ugh. Right on the freaking cusp. <laughs> we need like 19, 1800 XP. Dang it. All right, so basically we're gonna have to return to the ship to return here, but then we get to use the super cool option where we convince her that the toothpaste is actually rocket fuel and probably get a lot more goodies hey. and maybe even keep the schematics to the gun and, and maybe this all does work out for the best. It's just gonna take a load screen to, to make it happen, it seems. All right, back to the unreliable. Take her to the ship, cash in the XP. Back to, <laughs> back to Gladys. This is where, like I said, like to me the biggest downfall of the game thus far is the loads. Everything else is pretty sweet. I, I do hope it improves in difficulty though. Or increases in difficulty, rather. Maybe some people would find the easiness appealing, but I don't like just like grabbing a quest, walking to the place, wiping everyone, check marking the quest, you know? There should be some challenge involved. Okay, Parvati is back to the ship. Morning. Hi. Have you have you asked her out yet? Hey, Captain. No, nope, you're okay. And I don't feel it today. Alright. Glad to hear it. I wouldn't mind having a drink. Okay. I messaged June Lei when we got back, and she replied super quick. <clears throat> okay. I was awake half the night, thinking about what I sent, anxious to see what you said. I reread my message in the morning, and it was unclear. I was drinking when I sent it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have had the courage. Also, sorry for the typos. Mm -mm. Okay, not bad so far. I've ruined things in the past because I didn't say things I should have, like, I've met someone who's become special to me. I want to be honest with her, so if she feels the same about me, there won't be any surprises. Oh, isn't she sweet? Like one of those two-bit romances where one soul's all stiff and formal, and I should be glad to perhaps take hold of your hand, miss. I ought to go write her back. I mean, I already did. Twice. <laughs> but anyhow, thanks for taking me out, Captain. You are welcome. Give me that XP and the level up points. Okay, sweet. I'm out of here. Thanks, Parvati. We're gonna rock and roll. We got our companions. Anthracillin purifies poisons, toxins, venoms. Fight what nature inflicts. Good for all that ails you. Antibiotics from Auntie Cleo. Pretty clever name. I like antibiotics. Medicine given to you by your aunt, it makes you better. So, hey, cures diseases, antibiotics. And over the years, it just converted to antibiotics because anti, auntie, you know, same difference, less letters. Doesn't seem like it's a family recipe. Feels a little more official. We're rewriting history here, baby. Okay, so I need, what, 40 lie and 20-something science or whatever. 
in order to pull off this big heist. Hopefully, hopefully it's like, we'll never know, but in my head it's like, oh, instead of getting like a hundred bits, we're gonna get a thousand bits or something, but I could be wrong, okay. There's that. And then was it 30 science? I believe? Something like that, right? 40 and 30, something like that. Um, okay. Cool, that's fine. Sounds good. All right. Let's go try to swindle Gladys. I don't feel bad about it. She's asking for so much for this nav key. It's taking so long just to get to the next planet. Not the end of the world to uh, make a little mischief. Is it now? Claim to be saints. We're just trying to save hope. I did just break my leg. Again. Gonna need a doctor after this. All right. Hello. Gracious. Sitting down for tea. I investigated the distress What's signal. What's that? Speak up now. Rinse and repeat. About those secrets. What'd you turn up? My big lie. Heck yeah. My stars, what a find. Fine picking like this deserves an equally fine payout. Yes? Go on, dearie. And don't spend it all in one place. How much you given me? 3750. Raptodon Musk. Yeah, we can also dump this. Oh, we didn't. We actually we didn't even need to turn those in, but we could. The ra okay. Um, or how much do you? I don't know. Pardon me, sweetheart. My old ears must have. Okay. A couple of folks around here might pay a fair few bits for this. Might even be able to start a bidding war. Failed the oh, only eighteen. Okay. Are you? All right. Can't say I wasn't hoping for more, but. I suppose it can't be helped. Law bless you for doing the legwork, sweetie. Don't forget your pal Gladys now. You can come visit anytime. Do I get the key for free or I have to just I still have to buy it, okay. Nah. Fantastic. Do be careful with it, dear, as these keys tend to be a tad hard to acquire. You should have a chat with Lilia Hagen in the sublight offices. She's a dear. You'll love her. Now, was there anything else? Um, any? I think we're good. So we could go. You're gonna get. I think you're probably gonna upset if I picked up. Yeah. The why are there bad dudes around here? Um. Anyhow. Hey boss, if you need a tour guide, I've seen all twelve episodes of Terror on Monarch. I have you now. So, anyways, we can go back and return Vulcan's hammer at Rose Way if we want at some point. Um, inform Dr. Wells, you have a nav key. There's also Salvager in the sky. We're, okay, so I gotta go back and speak to her now that I have the access. Since that's a thing. We're going to Monarch, baby, and we're gonna make it happen very soon. Take me to your leader. What kind of mission do you got? We didn't really inquire about what they were doing here. I like that we can now see our friends. This is just Felix's default face, so it's, it's not really a helmet anymore. He's assuming the persona of Moon Man. All right, Sublight, Lilia, what do you got for me? Make this conversation worth my time, Dude, Captain. Dude, you told me to come back, so I don't know what that sass is about. Sure is. Welcome aboard, contractor. One of my guys in Stellar Bay has a lead on some high-grade salvage, but he went dark before he could spill the goods. We arranged a drop at the Saltuna Warehouse's loading dock. Find whatever he left there and take it to Fallbrook. My gal Catherine will be expecting you. Is Fallbrook from Fallout? Sounds like it. A few of my contractors run flights in there and out again, working around the board embargo. We keep the community lubricated with a steady supply of booze and unconventional erotica. Wow. Byzantium kids with more money than sense can thank Sublight <laughs> for their good time. Byzantium is going to be an interesting place to go for sure. One of my guys filmed a Raptodon grinding on an auto mech. Didn't end well for anyone, including the cameraman. Whoops. I'll take it. <laughs> now get going. Catherine will brief you on the details when you check in with her at Fallbrook. One last thing. When you're on the job, keep a pair of eyes in the back of your head. Understood? He sounds shady. Could be. You'll do fine. Probably nothing to worry about. 
Probably. I ain't worried if you aren't, Captain. Uh, honest. Sounds good. All right. I feel like this is where the game is really going to open up. You know, we had the beginning, the beginning mission, obviously, on Emerald Val. That was kind of like just welcoming you to the game, teaching you things. And then here, like, opening up more, kind of teaching you more about the world, learning what you got going on. But I feel like now, now things are about to get wild, don't you think? I feel, ooh, I want to, um, is there a workbench nearby? I think there's one up here. Here, right, or maybe it's right through here. Workbench, workbench. I want to mod the shotgun. Um, just because I, I really like this shotgun a lot, and it's level eight, so I feel like that's okay for now. Um, plasma shotgun, shock shotgun. Let's go plasma shotgun. That seems pretty fun. I have double of them anyway, so there we go. Plasma. Um, the Bolter Tech pistol is pretty sweet. Maybe not the greatest. The hunting rifle is so bad. I really want something better. I do have this grenade launcher. What does tinkering allow us to do? Oh, for different uh, bits and tinker, we can upgrade the damage. That's interesting. Huh. I unlocked the tinker skills. So, like, I can take this. Cost 62 bits to boost it. Yeah, that's kind of cool. All right, now it's a little bit better. That's kind of fun. Um, I like that a lot. Oh, do I have any... Did I get any better armor? I didn't. What is the armor I have equipped right now? It is Elite Troop Armor 23 Armor. Elite Troop Armor Aramid Ballista. Is it... What is this? It's level 11. Oh, it's because it's downgrading in quality. Um... I mean, this is pretty good armor. We can make this... It it ruins stealth, so it might be good to actually put stealth back into this one. I feel like our stealth has been kind of lame lately. So let's take this and put a stealth mod on it. Um, that's tech skills. That's stealth. Cool. Sweet. All right. We are ready to go. Raring to adventure off. And like I said, I think this is where everything kind of opens up. We've got a whole bunch of places to travel, a whole bunch of people to see, a whole bunch of missions. Um, Stellar Bay is where we can head. I'm guessing that's on Monarch? But our adventure kind of begins proper here. I mean, after all this time, it's already been pretty proper and pretty awesome, but I think it's going to expand tremendously. So we'll come back with that next time. Until then, everybody, thanks so much for watching. Hope you have a fantastic day and enjoying the videos. If you are, give them a big thumbs up. Share them with your friends. Leave a comment. Tell me your favorite character thus far and how devoted you are to the Moon Man life. Till next time, though. Drink so much, y'all. Thanks again. Love you all. And we'll see you all later.